Governments make many decisions which affect the public health. Laws and spending decisions about environmental health, about product safety, about marketing of unhealthy products and about what investments are made in preventive health programs. If decisions aren't made in the public interest, the health of everyone in Australia suffers. It means more cancers, more obesity driving food and drink consumed, especially by kids, more fossil fuel subsidies, weaker regulation on gambling, unsafe water, many other health threats. But the sad truth is that many industries have built their commercial model around limiting government decisions in order to maximise their profits. The lobbying that goes on in and around Parliament House would shock you. We just recently saw the alcohol industry donate $700,000 in a year to the major political parties and then seek a $150 million tax discount for themselves. We just don't know how much money unhealthy industries spend on buying our representatives because legal loopholes allow for multiple hidden donations. And we don't know what lobbyists are getting in and around Parliament House because there's virtually no public record. We do know there's a revolving door between lobbyists and ministerial staff and ministers themselves because there's lucrative job opportunities after people have finished their public service. We need real and urgent reform of the integrity laws in Australia. We need to know which lobbyists are operating in Parliament House and which ministers and advisers they're speaking to. We need to know how they're spending money on campaigns and on donations to political parties. Some states have actually banned donations from unhealthy industries like tobacco and gambling, and we need that to be done too at the Commonwealth level. Above all, we need a strong integrity commission to police the laws we do have. In a few weeks' time, we'll be voting to elect a new Australian Parliament. If you're interested in public health, demand of any candidate or party you're thinking of supporting that they commit to real and urgent reform of the integrity rules and vote for public health.